morning welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new she's pretending not to listen to me but we're currently in the car and we have a Walmart grocery order to pick up and after I made the order and sometime in the middle of the night I realized I had more stuff I needed to get so I think we might be going into Walmart as well so this is going to be um, grocery haul I guess as normal and of course, we need to stop for coffee. Here's our coffee. So, we made it to Walmart. And like, I know it's like a Wednesday. It's a Thursday. <laughs> Holy crap, okay. I know it's Thursday and I don't do order pickups that often. If I do, it's Walmart Target. I prefer Target. It's so much, the experience is so much like smoother. But I have to say, I pulled up, said where I was at, and like not even two minutes later, he was out. And the guy was so nice. And his story is like, saying, she like was like, thank you. And as I rolled up my window to the driveway so I'm in a new spot now because I'm going to go inside Walmart. I realized, should we be tipping them? Or have we been tipping them? I just never done it because this is new to me. I feel so bad. Like, are we supposed to tip? Do you guys tip? Let me know. I don't know. I, I just felt like in that moment I was supposed to give him a tip. I don't know if he was like expecting it or m me just feeling guilty for someone doing something for me. But I feel like I need to give a tip. I don't know. Let me know. But we're going to go inside Walmart. Okay. We're back. It doesn't seem like a lot, but it was just little things that we needed. Apparently, we're getting really bad storms in the next two days. And the stores are going to be crazy. So, I figured I'm going to pick it up before people go crazy. So, here's what I got. These were the main two things I needed. And I didn't want to get in the store. So, that's why I ordered it. <laughs> I still had to bring it inside. So, what was the point of that? I don't know. But 35 pounds of litter. 15 pounds of cat food. Which, I wanted the bigger one, but they didn't have it. So, here's that. These are the items I picked up in store. I mainly forgot this. And they didn't have what I wanted so we're going to try this <laughs> off brand head and shoulders but anyways i found this in the clearance section it's a magnet and a clip and historia loves bruno so and then i found some of these i did already get baby food but this is a different kind and it doesn't expire for a while so got those i got this i used to use set of fill a lot back in the day and I haven't used it in many years, so I'm going to give it a little try before I commit to it again. And then, it's ran a plastic right there. But i got some more hair ties for Historia and some coloring pencils because apparently we don't have any. And me and my sister were both looking for some. So, moving on. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but Levi has really bad eczema. So, I'm going to try these two out on him. Historia also has eczema. And I know some products already don't, don't work well, so I'm trying different products this time around. So I got this one. I don't know. It, it doesn't say there's steroids, and his doctor says he needs a little bit of steroids. I forgot how much he said, but I'm going to try that out. And then I know this works. A friend of mine has gave this to me. Um, prevent. Oh, I think they swapped this out. Darn. Okay, yeah, so I wanted this one. I wanted the aid. It's skin protection first aid. A friend of mine gave this to me a while ago and it worked like magic. And they swapped it out for this one. Dang it. I already have a ginormous tube of this. So that sucks. Okay, well I guess I'll have to go shopping for this another time. I know for a fact this one works, but I didn't want to use it because it smells... It didn't smell the best, so I wanted to try something else and just have it as a backup, but now I just randomly have that, okay. Well, it's fine. Anyway, so we got cheese, some cheese, hot dogs, pepperoni. I really like to have some type of pepperoni because me and his daughter will snack on these, and it's really good. So I don't like go to chips or something, but, which I should have got chips for Historia. She's fine. But I got this. I don't normally use this brand. I've never used this brand. This is like the jelly brand. 
you know, Smucker's. But I saw that it was sugar free, so I figured I'm gonna try it out. I don't normally just get any syrup, I normally get that brand, name brand, and ugh, my camera's not gonna focus, but for two tablespoons, there is 25 grams of carbs. It's kind of a lot, actually. Let me compare it. So I think, without you guys judging my junk drawer, this is the brand I normally get. And it's 27 grams of carbs per two tablespoons. And it's a little bit, it's 20 more calories. Okay, this one is better by like a smidge. So whatever, we're going to try it out. This one is not sugar free, but there's no sugar in it. No, there is total sugar. Okay. So this one has 16 grams of total sugar. And... This one only has sugar alcohol, so I guess this one is better. But yeah, I just wanted to try this out. Anyways, um, this is another thing they swapped out. I haven't used my Nespresso machine in well over a year because it was in storage. And I wanted the blonde, and they told me that they might not have it. So I guess this is what they substitute it for. Um, I'm sure it's still good, but I know I like the blonde one, which is why I wanted that one. We got some Danimals, or my daughter likes to call it monkey juice. I don't know why that started. I think because the original Danimals has monkeys on it, and her friends, she got it from her friend. Her friend calls it monkey juice, but we got more Danimals. She'll drink so many of these a day. And then tortillas for my husband, tortillas for me, and I got some collagen again. I have not had collagen in quite some time. I used to use it every single day. I put it in my coffee, anything really. Um, after you have a baby, some collagen is something really good for you to have. I used to have it daily and I don't really know why I stopped. So this is the exact same brand I used to use back in the day. If you watch my old vlogs, you've probably seen me put this in my coffee every time. So I'm going back to that. And then the last two items I got is drinks for me, drinks for my husband. Oh, I forgot to show this actually. I did get some of this. I love me some Mio, so I'm trying a new flavor. Strawberry Pineapple Smash. Sounds delicious. And then I got some baby food. Sweet potatoes. Bananas. His favorite. So I got two bananas. Just kidding. Three bananas. Sweet corn and green beans. <laughs> that sounds horrible. Oh, another banana. Okay, so it looks like they swapped. I should only have two bananas, so they probably swapped two. That's fine, but here's about $145 at Walmart looks like and that's obviously not a huge grocery haul but some non grocery items. This is randomly on sale. I got this for like four bucks so that's pretty cool. Several days later. Good morning you guys. Happy Friday. I have COVID <laughs> for the second time. Um I'm on day like four I think I tested on Tuesday. I've been feeling like shit since Sunday night ish. I just, it started with the sore throat and then it just gradually got worse. I'm feeling a lot better. I'm not as weak and my head's not pounding so loud like there's a speaker in my head. You know, I just am congested and I have a sore throat and I'm still coughing, but for the most part, I feel alive. It's fine. This is way worse than last time around, but it's fine, whatever. I am currently going to water my orchid, <laughs> orchid, 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 I don't know why I can't pronounce it. Whatever the hell this is called, um, my mother-in-law gave this to me the day I had my son. And he started, it started to die because I forgot about it, but I brought her back to life. She's beautiful. I found out you're only supposed to water them once a week. I did not know that. So, tell me this. It came in this beautiful pot, but she is getting very big. She was where you guys are sitting. This is my window mantle thing, and I'm starting to think... Do I need to move her 
and do I need to repot her because look at this is that okay am I supposed to do something about that I kind of feel like she is getting really overgrown in there and I don't know like what to do about it but also like that kind of freaks me out like I don't know if I want to touch that I don't know. You guys, if you are plant people, please let me know what I should do about this. We literally have not been doing anything. I re really wanted to clean just the house in general. I let the floors get really bad. There's trash right there. Like, it's just, I really didn't do much this week because I feel like shit. And I did run around the house with Historia, which then made me feel worse. So I shouldn't have done that, but she just is always begging for someone to go get her. So she wants to be chased. So I forgot what I was going to say. Oh yeah, I'm thinking of putting in some music on and just like cleaning everything up. Well, not, not everything. I'm going to clean what my body will allow me to do because I just feel like so stuck. But I obviously can't do it anymore. Like it's just so dirty. Like it needs to be vacuumed and swept. And I didn't mop last week. So it really needs to be mopped. There's like milk on the floor. It just doesn't look good. It's the next day. It's actually four in the afternoon. I'm just now getting ready, getting around to taking a shower and just getting ready. I just don't feel good still. I retook my COVID test today and I'm negative for COVID, but I am still sick. Not horribly, but I still don't feel that great. It doesn't help the fact that Levi just isn't sleeping good right now. He was just up a lot last night and he's not really taking naps either so I don't know if it's his teething or if he's going through a growth spur. He's going to be six months old in like four days so I don't know. But I am exhausted. My toddler also didn't take a nap today so no rest for me. But my husband is going to go out and do some uber and I just wanted to shower before he left so that way he could watch the kids but um I never did any of the cleaning I said I was going to do yesterday but I'm just going to do small tasks you know like small things I've been putting off that just needs to get done like I gotta get rid of um some toys and I wanted to hang some things up so I'm just going to do that instead and still like rest, you know, like not do too much. I have a ton of laundry, but it's just going to have to wait. I don't feel good. <laughs> this. So I have not picked up the camera since I have a shower maybe. I came downstairs and <laughs> Ruben had both kids passed out on his lap. I moved Levi and he did not stay asleep. <clears throat> He's actually downstairs in his walker. But his story got moved to her bed and did sleep. So she slept for two and a half hours. She's awake now. She's a little grumpy. <clears throat> so we're gonna go outside and drive her Elsa car. Yeah? We're in the garage now. This lighting is insane. So the lighting in the garage got changed a few days ago. My husband picked this up from Home Depot, I think. And it's like so bright in here. My glasses make it hard to see, but it's like amazing. I'm like, oh my God, you can see everything. It's like not even scary being in the garage. So <laughs> much. Oh, it's so funny. Are you ready for Andy to come back? Yeah. Yeah? Hey, how are you hurt? Oh, okay. Because it's going to fly. Oh, it's going to fly? Because you're super strong? Yeah, I am strong. Yeah, <laughs> you are. So after our very short walk, um, she ended up going with her scooter. I don't know why. She's been bugging to ride her Elsa car. She got for her birthday, but she went for her scooter instead. And she's not very good at it. So we literally went down the street and right back up. But I actually just got in my car really quick. And ran over two blocks over. I mean, 
it was two blocks over this was really down there but um somebody was giving away a litter box and like a water jug thing which we used to have but it broke so i was like i'll come take it and i did room was supposed to get it early early day and i felt really bad and he already left to go do uber so i just wanted to pick it up so now we have a new litter box anyway i'm home now that was super quick <music>